See this? That faint shadow of the taskbar. That's OLED burn in, and it can happen in as little as two weeks of heavy use. Once it's there, it's permanent. But here's the thing. These Windows 11 settings take just two minutes to change, but could save you $2,000 on screen replacement. Let me show you the tweaks that will extend your OLED's life. First, tackle the biggest culprit, your taskbar. That bright, static bar is OLED enemy number one. Set it to auto-hide so it disappears when not needed. Right-click taskbar, go to taskbar settings, and turn on automatically hide the taskbar. It disappears when not in use, giving you low burn-in risk from that area. Also, clean up your system tray. Fewer static icons mean fewer permanent bright spots. Next, go full dark mode. OLED pixels literally turn off when displaying black, using zero power and preventing wear. Go to settings, personalization, colors, dark. But don't stop there. Enable dark mode in your browser, office apps, and any software you use daily. Every white pixel saved extends your screen's life. Keep those pixels moving. Set up a slideshow wallpaper that changes every 10 to 30 minutes. Or try animated wallpapers with live wallpaper. Static bright images are burn-in magnets. Also, enable focus assist during your main work hours. It reduces notification pop-ups that create static elements in the same spot repeatedly. Set aggressive screen timeouts, three to five minutes max. Some manufacturers like Lenovo already do this by default on OLED laptops. Go to settings, system, power and battery, then screen and sleep section. For brightness, stick to 50 to 70% for daily use. Enable auto brightness if available. It prevents you from accidentally running full brightness for hours. And here's a key point about HDR. It's not HDR itself that's the problem. It's sustained high brightness with static content. Use HDR when needed, but don't leave it forced on 24-7. Windows 11 actually has some built-in OLED care. It automatically shifts UI elements slightly over time and manages display refresh cycles. Your laptop might also have manufacturer tools. Look for pixel refresh, panel compensation, or OLED care in your display settings or manufacturer software. These typically run automatically during sleep or shutdown, so don't interrupt them. Be careful with apps that have persistent bright elements. Always on status bars, stock tickers, system monitors with static layouts. These are burn-in risks. If you must use them, position them in different screen areas regularly or use them on a secondary non-OLED display. Also, avoid leaving the same web page open for hours if it has bright, static headers. Here's the reality. OLED burn-in isn't guaranteed, but prevention is way easier than dealing with a damaged $500 plus screen. With AI and dynamic interfaces coming to Windows, Microsoft is clearly thinking about this too. These simple changes now will keep your display looking perfect for years. So there's your OLED protection playbook, auto-hide taskbar, dark mode everything, dynamic wallpapers, smart timeouts, and watch those static apps. Do you have an OLED laptop or monitor? Drop the brand below and tell me if you've noticed any image retention yet. Subscribe for more Windows optimization that actually matters. I'll see you in the next one.